Hi guys, today we are reviewing the ICE PANBCDABU.S.13 watch. In review we'll go through the features, style as well as the dimensions. So, without further ado, let's get started. This watch is from the ICE Pantone range. This one is what they call Dazzling Blue. The Pantone Universe colour is 183949. Um, it's part of a ICE range of Pantone Universe watches, which I'll come to later. The main thing is you can see that the Pantone colour, the Dazzling Blue, is on the case of the watch. It's a plastic case as always. You've got a stainless steel crown with the ICE logo in it. Then we've got the silicon strap. The silicon strap again is in the dazzling blue. We have a watch retainer which also has the Pantone universe and the colour number and designation of dazzling blue. This is in white. The underside of the silicon strap is white so it's a two-tone strap as you get in a lot of the new ice watches. That also includes around at the underneath you get this little white marker in one side of the strap. The buckle is just a basic stainless steel, no markings or anything on it. We have a nice stainless steel screw on back. This tells us the watch is 10 atoms or 100 meters water resistant. So as always with a lot of these ice watches, you can take it swimming, um, take it in a bath, shower, whatever, if you want to. You also notice as with a lot of these ice watches, they have the ice lettering around the corners of the case under the little shoulders. So you've got I, C, E, and then a little logo under there. If we come into the face, the face we've got a nice white edged plastic bezel. We've got the dazzling blue in metal around the edge of the bezel and we've got the luminous dot at the top as always. The bezel of course is fully rotating. We have the dazzling blue face. On the inside, on the shoulder inside the face we've got little white markers to show the minutes. And then we've got this half face, which you may have seen on the other Pantone watches I've done before, where you've got bottom half is just white with the logo in it. Top half is dazzling blue. You've got a 12 and 9 in luminous paint and chrome surrounds. And you've got a few or four hour markers in luminous paint. You have a date window. The date window is sort of a white background with a silver chrome edge to it and a cyclops. And then you've got the hands, the hour and minutes hands are both chrome with luminous painting. The second hand, as always with the Pantone watches, is in the same colour as the watch. So the second hand is a dazzling blue hand and we've got a luminous dot at the end of that hand. Down the bottom of the face in the white part it also tells us again that the watch is 10 atoms water resistant. So 100 metres water resistant. So it's a very, very stylish watch. As I said, I have got a few of these watches. These watches are, I would say, collector pieces now. The model number on this watch designates that it was released in 2013, or is made in 2013. Most of these watches were. There's a couple of 2014 models. There's a large collection of the Pantone watches, but they did stop producing them a while back. So these are really now just a case of what you can get, when you can get. So they're not always in perfect condition. You see this one's got a few scratches on the bezel, a um, few scratches around on the back of the case. That's just simply because the watch is old, it's used. I don't intend to display these watches. I don't buy these ones for display purposes, so I don't mind them being a bit marked, a bit scratched, because I wear them. If you were out as a true out-and-out -out collector, I imagine you'd probably look for the whole case, everything you could get for the watch, to save it somewhere safe and look after it and have it sort of like never out of its case and just for display purposes. This watch did come with a dazzling blue case. Again, matches the watch. got blue with the white on it. Um, very nice looking case, but again, that's in the loft. I intend to wear the watch, so I'm not displaying it with the case or anything like that. If we come to the sizes, the face on this watch is 30 millimeters. The case is 40 millimeters. If you include the crown, that makes it 43 millimeters, which ICE will call their um, unisex size. The strap is 20 millimeters across from side to side. It's not a very deep watch. They never are. These watches are... 12 millimeters from face to back in depth and weight wise because it's all silicon um, and a tiny bit of stainless steel here it's only weighing 56 grams so it's a nice lightweight watch very comfortable watch to wear 
there we go sort that out and a very good looking watch as i said if you're looking at collecting any form of watches especially if you look at ice watches then this is one of the more collectible pieces because there's more choice and um, they're getting hard to find so it's quite a challenge to get hold of them which is quite a nice challenge to try and find them anyway guys i hope you like the review if you do please hit the like button down below hit the subscribe if you want to see more watch reviews hit the bell so you can be notified when i upload the watch reviews and thanks for watching bye bye <music>